Recently, OpenAI launched Sora 2, and right after that, Google dropped another bombshell with VO 3.1. Naturally, I thought these two giants would dominate the AI video space for the rest of this year. But out of nowhere, a Chinese company called Minimax has just unleashed its latest update, Hiluo 2.3, and it's blowing everyone's minds. Hiluo 2.3 doesn't just compete with Sora 2 and Veo 3, it might actually crush them. In this video, I'll show you why creators everywhere are talking about Hiluo 2.3, what makes it so powerful, and how it performs against the world's biggest AI video generators. When you visit the site, the interface immediately feels faster and cleaner than before. By the way, I've left the link to the site in the description below. You'll notice they've upgraded from Hiluo 02 to Hiluo 2.3, and there are two versions, but I am choosing this for enhanced quality. With this version, you can generate videos from text, upload an image, or even use a reference character. But for now, let's start with text to video and see what it can really do. I started with a physics heavy prompt. A skilled male acrobat performs two flawless backflips while standing on the back of a moving donkey, dust rising from the ground, slow motion capture, cinematic handheld camera tracking the stunt. Notice that I included keywords like slow motion capture and cinematic handheld camera tracking to add dynamic movement and help the AI understand the kind of motion I want in the scene. Now let's hit generate and see what it creates. The result looks almost real. Every frame follows gravity perfectly and the balance looks natural. However, there is a little glitch and there are two donkeys instead of one, but the physics is impressive. When I ran the exact same prompt on Veo 3.1 and Sora 2, this is what I got. Unfortunately, the other two models didn't perform well in this test. When you look at the results from Sora, instead of the acrobat doing backflips on top of the donkey, he actually falls off and starts flipping on the ground. Then with Veo 3, the physics completely fall apart. If you look closely, the person isn't really flipping at all. The head and chest stay frozen in one direction, while the legs rotate almost 360 degrees, breaking the motion entirely. For this test, Hiluo 2.3 clearly takes the win. Next, I tested how well it handles tension and balance. I prompted, a circus performer carefully walks across a tightrope high above a cheering crowd, arms stretched for balance as the rope sways in the wind. The rope's movement reacts beautifully to each step, reflecting realistic physics and the performer maintains balance with lifelike precision. However, her motion feels slightly more like a graceful dance than a tense balancing act. Comparing that to Sora 2, the movement appears slower and but smooth. VO3 performed a bit better this time, alternating between wide and close-up shots for a more cinematic feel. But there's one major flaw. When the performer loses balance and falls, her body floats in mid-air, leaving a gap between her and the rope which completely breaks the laws of physics. For this round, I'll close one eye and call it a tie between all three. Then I decided to push Hiluo 2.3's limits in group dynamics and motion tracking. I used this prompt, a team of acrobats forming a human pyramid outdoors at sunset, the wind blowing their clothing, muscles tensing as they climb, captured by a rotating wide angle camera. This scene is perfect for testing, coordination, and balance between multiple characters while keeping motion consistent across the frame. The animation looked truly cinematic, capturing every subtle movement and shift in balance. It maintained the same number of people throughout the scene, and no one disappeared midway like what usually happens with most video generators. Neither Sora 2 nor VO3 managed to handle that many characters with such natural coordination. Sora 2 skipped the actual formation process entirely, showing the pyramid already built which missed the whole point of the prompt. VO3 tried to show the formation, but the people kept merging and fading into one another, completely breaking the realism of the scene. Again, Heiluo 2.3 takes the win. Of course, physics isn't everything. I wanted to see how well it handles mood and light. I used this prompt. A performer on a dimly lit stage juggling three glowing balls, reflections bouncing off each ball as the audience claps in the background. The result came out surprisingly accurate, with the performer's anatomy and motion looking completely natural. The only minor issue was that he juggled two balls instead of the three specified in the prompt. The glowing balls illuminated his face beautifully, and both his hands and eyes adjusted perfectly during the movement. Not a single ball dropped. 
This is something Sora 2 and VO3 failed to achieve. In Sora 2, the balls were bouncing randomly from nowhere, breaking the realism. VO3.1 tried to simulate juggling, but more balls kept appearing with heavy morphing, making it look chaotic. Once again, Hyluo 2.3 takes the clear win for this test. This time, I wanted to test how good it is when it comes to action scenes. This is the prompt that I typed. A mountain biker speeding along a rocky trail at sunrise, dust flying behind the tires, performing a clean backflip over a ridge as the camera follows in slow motion. The sense of depth and camera stability were absolutely stunning. When I slowed down the clip, you could clearly see that the backflip was smooth and followed accurate physics, though the action stopped midway since I generated only a six second clip. When I ran the same concept through other models, Sora 2 delivered a cinematic look with decent physics, but the biker never actually performed the flip. VO 3.1 did slightly better, yet instead of flipping, the biker rotated the bike horizontally, completely ignoring the prompt. For this test, Hyluo 2.3 once again stands out as the clear winner. Now, let's talk about combat and crowd control. This is the prompt I gave Hyluo 2.3. Two professional wrestlers grapple in a packed arena under flashing lights, sweat particles flying, fans roaring. The collisions, muscle tension, and camera flashes looked spectacular. We start with a wide shot as the camera slowly zooms in, revealing two wrestlers locked in a heated battle. The physics feel accurate, and each movement looks powerful and grounded. Both fighters show raw energy and determination, and from the look of it, neither is ready to give up. It feels like a real championship match. When comparing the results, Sora 2 also delivered impressive realism with believable energy, capturing the intensity just like a professional sports camera. Veo 3.1 tried as well, but its motion felt noticeably slower and lacked the same sense of force. In this round, all models followed the prompt and showed solid physics, but Hyluo 2.3 and Sora 2 stood out slightly ahead of VO 3.1. Then I tested close-range choreography. Two martial artists sparring in a dojo, trading fast punches and kicks as the camera rotates around them. The fight had strong momentum, controlled pacing, and a smooth parallax effect that gave it real cinematic depth. The skin deformation during each strike looked believable and natural, not stretched or rubbery. When testing the same prompt on Sora 2, it followed the instructions more accurately, with fast, well-timed punches and realistic movement that felt truly dynamic. It actually performed better than Hyluo 2.3 inches this round. On the other hand, VO 3.1 completely missed the mark. The motion was slow, filled with minor glitches, and the dust effects from the tiled floor looked fake and disconnected from the action. Honestly, for this test, Sora 2 takes the win. And of course, I had to test the internet's favorite chaos prompt, Will Smith eating spaghetti. Surprisingly, Haluo 2.3 actually generated the real Will Smith, and the resemblance was uncanny. His facial expressions were spot on, and he even blinked mid-bite. You could almost imagine him saying, I'm tired of eating spaghetti. Sora 2 totally refused to generate the video due to celebrity likeness, and VO 3.1 blocked the prompt entirely stating it violated their content policies. So, in terms of world understanding and likeness accuracy, Hyluo 2.3 takes the win once again. When it comes to image to video, Hyluo 2.3 really shows how well it handles scenes with many people. I tested it using an image of soldiers marching across a desert base at sunset, surrounded by tents and armored vehicles. Hyluo 2.3 does not yet support end frames yet like Veo 3. This was my prompt, and then I hit generate. The result looked incredible. Each soldier moved naturally with subtle variations in pace and posture while the sunlight shifted smoothly across the frame. The dust particles and shadows reacted realistically to the motion, creating a lifelike atmosphere. You can even spot one soldier stumbling slightly as if he stepped on a stone, a small natural imperfection that made the scene feel real. Despite the number of moving figures, there was no distortion or flicker something Sora 2 still struggles with since it doesn't yet generate videos from uploaded images of realistic people, even when the image itself is AI generated. VO3's frames to video mode also produced an impressive result, maintaining a consistent motion pattern with only minimal distortion. For this test, I'll give a point to both Hyluo 2.3 and VO3.1. For our last test, let's try a battle scene. 
I used this intense battle image of soldiers facing a massive alien creature. The scene is filled with motion, light bursts, and chaotic energy, making it perfect for evaluating how well the model understands action and focus. The prompt I used was, a group of armed soldiers fires at a giant glowing alien creature at night. Muzzle flashes illuminate the scene as sparks and dust fill the air. The camera slowly zooms in from a wide cinematic shot, maintaining focus on the creature while capturing the intensity, lighting, and energy of the battle with realistic motion and depth. The result looked incredible. Hiluo 2.3 kept the zoom perfectly smooth, with the focus shifting naturally as the creature grew larger in the frame. The lighting adapted beautifully to every muzzle flash, and while there were a few slight morphing artifacts on the creature's tentacles, the overall shot still felt impressively real. The model handled the dynamic motion and flickering gunfire without any noticeable distortion, and the atmosphere filled with dust and smoke added a convincing sense of depth. Sora 2 once again failed to generate this scene, while Veo 3.1 tried to perform better in this battle sequence. However, instead of the soldiers aiming at the creature's center, they were firing at its legs, and the creature itself kept deforming. Its head changed shape, and the mouth opening caused the model to alter the uploaded image significantly. For this test, the point clearly goes to Hiluo 2.3. One of the current limitations of Hiluo 2.3 is that it doesn't include built-in sound yet. Every clip you generate is silent, so you'll need to add background music or ambient effects using an editing program or an AI audio tool. In summary, Hiluo 2.3 feels like the first real competitor to OpenAI's Sora 2 and Google's Veo 3. It delivers impressive physics accuracy, dynamic lighting, and cinematic camera motion while remaining fast and easy to use. Whether you're a filmmaker, storyteller, or just someone fascinated by the future of AI-generated video, this update is absolutely worth exploring. Try it yourself with four free generations every day. The results will genuinely surprise you. If you found this breakdown helpful, make sure to like, share, and subscribe for more deep dives into the best AI video tools out there, because the AI video war has only just begun.